Let's go ahead and just jump right in. I have a ton of new finds to share with you guys all from Amazon and I'll have them all linked down below in the description box too for easy shopping. So first item that I wanna kick us off with after I remove little hair on it is this white Sherpa belt bag. Last time I did this video, I showed you guys the black one, which I love, but then I got this one in and it's equally just as gorgeous and one of my favorite, favorite finds. It actually has all of like my personal items in it, my cards and everything, um, because I've been grabbing for this bag and using it nonstop. It's really cute. The perfect size, same as the black. It has the beautiful gold hardware on it, which I love. I think it's so pretty and it holds so much stuff let me see if i can open it up and just take out my cards but and like maybe some of my receipts here's what i have going on in it currently a ton of stuff i have some lipstick tampons lip gloss airpods um one of these little guys which these are the best by the way i don't know if you can get these on amazon or not i'll check but this is one of the touchland touchland touch land what <laughs> what is my problem touch land whatever this is one of the cutie little uh hand sanitizers and this one smells really really nice anyways i got us way off topic um this fits a lot in here and i usually keep my cards in this little pocket to the side so i've been loving the sherpa i think it's really cute but as we go into warmer months um they do have just plain options and i don't know where it is but i had gotten a pink one um which i love i'll probably snag some neutral colors in just like the regular material on this so i have them but such a great find such a great purchase i wear these non-stop let me see if i can show you like look she's so cute i should have fixed my hoodie but it's just so great i love it 10 out of 10. Moving us right along, I have two pairs of sunglasses that I love, and these are both under, I think, $20. Um, this is my all-time favorite pair, and these are $15. I just recently repurchased these just because my last ones got so much wear from last year, I needed a fresh pair. The lenses are probably a little dirty because I just got back from vacation and obviously took these, but I love a round lens. They're so cute. They're lightweight. I just love how they look on me and I love that they're not super expensive. I'm the type of person I don't trust myself with super expensive sunglasses at this point, maybe later in life, but not right now. Um, so I love the $15 ones. And then these are my latest favorite pair. I love the shape of these frames. They're a geometric shape. I just think they're so cute. They're very similar to the round pair, but a little different. So same, same, but different. I obviously have a type when it comes to sunglasses, um, but I just love these so much. I love the gold detailing on them, the black lens. And again, they're not super expensive. So absolutely love these. And these have a little like tortoise detailing on the, what do we call this? I'm blanking. The earpiece, I guess. Whatever this is called, I like the little tortoise shell detailing on it. I think it's super cute. So I got these slippers and another latest obsession of mine. I just love these. I am a slipper fanatic connoisseur. Like, why is my hair all over everything? I just love slippers. I love cozy things. So I got these. I kept seeing them and finally decided to pick them up. And they're just so cute. And I've gotten so much wear and use out of them. I love the little smiley too. I think it's really fun and cute. I love the touch of pink on them. Um, and they're really soft and comfy on the inside and they have a hard bottom on the bottom. They have a hard sole, uh, which I like. So anyway, it kind of has this fun little material on the outside and then like I mentioned, they're just like really soft and cozy on the inside and they come in a thousand different colors, literally so many different color combinations of the smiley, but these are really cute. I've been wearing them nonstop and these are also true to size. I got the 37, 38, um, which I can't remember what that like translates into in like shoe sizes. Usually I'm a six or a six and a half, but anyways, 
37, 38 is what I got and they fit perfectly. I'm really excited to share these next two with you guys. I feel like you'll either love them or hate them, but I love them and they are same, same, but different. So I really wanted to try out the puffer bag trend that I kept seeing. So I first had grabbed this one from Amazon. Um, it's a quilted puffer white bag and it had these straps on it and then it has these little straps on it which is interesting so if you're not using one of them you just would tuck them into the bag unless you like want them out and about um but i have personally been liking the longer straps um it has a little clip on the inside so you can clip it shut and then it also has a zipper uh inside it has a little lining too and i'm not gonna lie it doesn't feel like super luxurious or anything kind of feels cheap but if you like the bag, then, you know, I feel like it's easy to look past. Um, but I just wanted something that was like easy for running out the door, running errands. If I had some larger things I wanted to carry, mainly I wanted something cute. If I had my iPad with me or my laptop and this has turned out to be a really great option. So I really do like it. Uh, I'm not good at reading dimensions on things, so it was a little bit smaller than I was anticipating, which ended up being fine because I got this one. And I'm sure you can see the size difference. This is like the size that I was thinking this one was gonna be. Uh, but now that I have both, and they're both different finishes and colors, like slightly. So it all worked out. Um, this one is definitely a little bit more, it probably doesn't look it on camera, but it has a little bit more yellow to it than this one. This bag is the exact same concept, uh, but it's obviously larger. And then it has that pearlized sort of coating to it. It reminds me of the Hailey Bieber donut nails. Um, I really like this bag. I love the size of it. This one also has the larger handles and then the smaller ones too. I've definitely been gravitating towards the longer ones. Um, and then it has a zipper and it has a lining to it. Um, which I don't know why this one just feels like a little bit nicer quality to me on the inside. Uh, than this one does, but both are great and I like them both for different reasons. I feel like this one would come in handy if you were like traveling and needed like, I wouldn't say a weekender bag because I think it's too small, but you know, just like a little overnight bag or something. This could be cute. Moving on, I did pick up a new workout set, which I have been loving. So this one is ribbed to no surprise. I feel like majority of my Amazon sets that I have are a ribbed material of some sort, but this one is a long sleeve crop top and I got it in black. It fits really, really nice. I got a size small. Um, and it has like this band at the bottom, which I guess is nice. It's like a little bit thicker. And I like the neckline on this too. It's probably hard to see, but whatever the neckline is on it, <laughs> really like it and you'll probably be able to get a better picture of it if you go to the link down below and like actually go to the listing um but all that to say it comes with that long sleeve crop top and then it comes with high-waisted matching leggings and i like these a lot um the fit is really nice i have worn this in one of my outfit reels that i've shared recently i think you can find it on my tiktok probably on my shorts and then also on my reels on my instagram um but very cute comes in a ton of colors and then to go with it i got this little fleecy zip up and this was so much nicer than i was anticipating it was a lot heavier um quality wise than i was anticipating which i was super happy with and i just love the fit of this it's so cozy i know i'm gonna get so much use out of this and i think this will be really great to have too for spring and like the transition into spring um so i love this so much it feels just so soft i got it in i can't remember if they call it white or more of a cream but this definitely has again like more of a yellow hue to it it's not a stark white even though it might look like that on camera um, I would say this is more of like a cream shade. It doesn't have pockets, which is fine, but I would say that's the only downside. Uh, but it does have a zipper in the front and it does have the little cinches that you could do too, to like just draw it in at your waist if you wanted to. It has a little collar on it too. So this was a great find. Also comes in a ton of different colors, but 
just knew myself and I knew this like cream white shade would be my best bet. And then lastly in the outfit category, which I actually have been wearing with the other two pieces that I just shared is this little baseball hat. Um, I've bought so many of these off of Amazon. I just love them. I love styling them with outfits, especially athleisure, loungewear, casual outfits. I think they're great. Um, so I wanted to get this white one and it has a navy blue little emblem on it. Uh, it is so funny because this hat has been a conversation starter so many times that I've worn it out and I don't mean for it to. I don't pick the hats based off of like baseball teams that I like. I'm sure that's obvious. I just pick them because I like them and I like the color that it comes in, but they're just so cute and I love a good little baseball hat. I have no idea if you all are gonna be interested in this, so hopefully you are, but I did wanna share my little planner that I restocked on and picked back up. Um, I can't live without this. I love it. It just keeps me so organized during the day and I love the layout of it. So this is my second time getting this. Um, it literally just says daily plan. It has a date section. You can circle the day of the week and then it has all these little sections, which hopefully, okay, I can't get the camera to focus on this at all. So I'll have to turn it around and I'll insert a little clip. Um, but it has today's focus. It has the schedule by time starting at six, ending at nine. So I love that it has all these little time slots and it has a line for like, um, like half hours too, which I like. Um, to do with little check boxes, notes, a meal section too, if you want to keep track of what you're eating, um, water, so you can like mark down your waters down here at the bottom, and then good things that happen today. So I just love the layout of this. I love the little boxes that it has. It keeps me super organized. If I have meetings, I love that I can just like write those down, or if I just need to like block time on my day and do little time block sections to keep me organized through my day, I can do that too. So this is a lifesaver. So now I'm gonna move into some beauty. This was a repurchase. I feel like I've talked about these a lot. I just don't know if I've talked about them on here, but these are one of my favorite eye patches ever. I love these. They're the Rose Eye Gels um, from Patchology, and I just love how they feel. I love the texture of them. They're like that gel consistency. They feel really cooling. You can put them in the fridge if you want, but yeah, these are my favorite, and I can't even tell you how many times I've repurchased them. I mean, I probably could if I go to my Amazon history, but I continuously rebuy them. They come with, um, I think, five, yeah, five in a pack. This is what they look like. They're so cute, they're pink, and yeah, I just love these. I find myself just grabbing for these all the time. And I'm the type of person where if I do not like the consistency of a product, of a mask, of like literally anything, I won't use it. I just won't grab for it. I won't open it up. I won't take the time to use it. But these I really like. They're not like messy to open up and use too, which I like. Um, and they have strawberry extract, whatever this is, rest oh how do i say this resveratrol which i think is like good for anti-aging um and then hyaluronic acid in them so if you're looking for a little eye mask i definitely recommend these and honestly too when i did my little bridesmaids baskets however long ago that was i included these in there too because i love them so much and then this i'm so excited about i literally gasped when i opened it because I own the original Sol de Janeiro uh, body spray, and I guess I must have the small version, which I thought already was huge. Um, so that's what I thought I was ordering, and then I opened this up, and it's this giant bottle. This just this is eight fluid ounces. This thing is huge. Um, so anyways, it's giant. I'm really happy that I got it, but I had no idea. I thought I was just buying, ordering, paying for the smaller size one that I'm used to. But long story long, I really wanted to try out this scent. I've only, like I said, had the original scent, which I love. Uh, but this is the Chirosa scent from Sol de Janeiro, which their brand is amazing. They have really amazing smelling body care products. And this is Brazilian Jasmine and Pink Dragon Fruit. It just smells so good. I love the scent of this. I feel like... Mm, it reminds me of something, but I can't put my finger on what. 
It just smells like so girly, very tropical, a little fruity. I just love it. I feel like it makes me smell so good and it lasts. If you've been waiting to try this or if you haven't tried the brand yet at all, take this as your sign. And then my last beauty find that I wanted to share with you guys is this Beach Waver or this Crimper. This is from Insert Name Here and I love this. The crimped curls, waves, whatever that it gives me are so beautiful. I love my hair when I use this. Um, it heats up really nicely. I of course love that it's pink. You can change the heat settings on it. And yeah, I just really like the size of the barrels too um, and how it looks on my hair when I use it. Obviously I didn't use it now. I have curls in, but um, I have quite a few videos, like hair videos, um, using this with my hair crimped. If you guys wanna check it out, they're probably under my shorts on here or they'd be on my TikTok and my reels. But yeah, the last few videos that I have with crimped hair, I used this barrel and it's stunning. So I have this added to my storefront as well. Um, and if you are interested in or looking for a beach waver to just switch up your hair, this is great. It's easy to use and I think you'll love how your hair looks with it. Well, that's going to wrap up and conclude today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing some new finds from Amazon. And as always, everything will be linked down below for easy shopping. But thank you guys again. Love you so, so much. And until next time. I'm already on my way on my way. Where you blushing? Sweet concussion